it's always good to find figures for super cheap when you're looking through old used figures and stuff. So I got this figure of Cream from um, Tiger and Bunny. And I did rewatch the show not too long ago. So when I saw this for super cheap, um, and it is a real figure. I got it from an actual um, Japanese store or whatever. Uh, shipping, of course, to the United States was a good amount. But for it being used, it is used. Um, I, it, it, it's supposed to be complete used for like five bucks, ten bucks, I think it was. Um, I'm not going to say no. So I definitely picked this up for me because I know nobody over here really watched Tiger and Bunny. Um, I do know that there's supposed to be a new season. I don't know when I'm going to upload this video, but um, maybe I'm pretty sure by the time I upload this video, season two will be out, hopefully. But anyways, um, I really loved the show back in high school uh, when it came out because uh, at the time there was no animes that were really about superheroes, like more in the American sense uh, of things. And so when I saw it, like, you know, I fell in love with it, um, even though it's I mean, it's not going to win any awards or be super crazy. I mean, of course, um, my hero has it beat in terms of like story and all that other stuff. But for the time being, um, when it came out, when I watched it as an easy, accessible anime at the time, for me, Tiger and Bunny, I freaking loved it. I loved how they were all sponsored. I loved all the, um, the little backstory for all the different characters and stuff, like, you know, all the different stuff. And then so when I saw Cream, um, I actually really did like her and then the guy that she's with, how they're pretty much like a play on uh, Harley Quinn and Joker. And I really do like Harley Quinn. So uh, she does come with a good amount of accessories. And so getting a little, you know, a little chibi... I know I'm not crazy about Chibi, but I mean, it was so cheap. And they said it was complete, so hopefully it is, which it does look like it is complete. Um, even with the little cardboard, little um, action fray stands, extra joints, extra stands, her own stand that actually has a thing on it, actually has words on it. I do like how Bandai, they do like little, like markups on their bases and stuff. Oh, that all looks great and this is an extra stand oh an extra stand maybe for the little <clears throat> stuffed animal thing that she controls uh, they can talk about oh here's for the for the little cardboard you really don't see like the, these little cardboard little phrases anymore at all and it looks like they I don't even think they oh they did um here we got the paper saying everything on the inside which is great um and so it is used but somebody in japan used it so i'm assuming everything should be intact and in great condition more joints more oh it's it's an extra for her umbrella neck joints arm and ball joints yeah well that's one thing that really sucks about the chibis is their arms are just little pegs so there's really no really good articulation but it looks like she does have a hand for the tea a hand for the hat and then just extra posing hands so she comes with a lot of stuff um, that's the thing too, is I'm noticing more because I, I do have an Android sometimes for friends and stuff. And I do notice sometimes with these Androids, um, they're super lacking in, in my opinion. They don't come with, I feel as if they don't come as much as what they used to. Um, oh yeah, no, she looks great. Oh, and her freaking earring. Oh yeah, her head is heavy, but it's a, it's a solid joint though. So they did repack it the best they could, which is great. Oh, her earring. Her earring is kind of similar to Blue Rose's earring. You can pop it out. But it's freaking eyeballs. Which is cool. I do like her outfit and everything. Is that with the Ouroboros? Whatever. Yeah. I think she looks freaking great. And I really don't see any... Her neck joint is a bit a bit loose. But I mean her head is heavy as heck. It's it's pretty... There's a good weight to this. To be honest. Um, I mean and, there, and it does have the spare joints. I could always just swap out the joints. Anyways though. I think she looks freaking great. Um, there's no real problems I can see with her straight off the bat. So that looks good. Let's pull out where her other head is. Freaking heavy as heck too. They're supposed to come apart though. Let's see if I can try to pull it apart. <clears throat> You're supposed to be able to pull them apart so you can inter swap pieces and stuff. Yeah. Oh, it's a bit dirty. You can see it's a bit dirty. Different size thing. So there we go. But I mean, it looks fine like that. It looks freaking great. That looks freaking good. Her hat has a tab on the back. How does she... How... Oh, it's in this one. This one is where her hat... Tabs in. There we go. Oh, yeah, that's freaking heavy, dude. I don't <laughs> I don't know how the heck they expected her to, to stay up like that with her freaking... The hat and 
all that other junk on her. And so let's... Oh, they even give you an extra earring? For the other head? If I can pop it out. Oh. Ooh, the umbrella, though. Try to... Oh, wait, I think she is missing something. That's not good. Oh, no, that's just open hand. Open... Oh, her hand is a separate piece. Her hand is a separate piece, so you can pop off her hands, which is good. Is it all of them? I think it's just on some of them. Good, really good amount of detail. I mean, they really didn't have to put the little... I think it was the Ouroboros, right? The little thing that Tiger is going crazy for to find out who the heck is it. Yeah. Very clean detail on that. And the little bear that they control. Is it gummy bears or something like that? Come on. There we go. And the bear looks really good too. Small little guy, but... Good amount of detail on it. Good paint and everything. And I'm just gonna dump the rest. I have a little organizer thing that I put all my extra pieces into. So I just put them all into like little mini Ziploc baggies and stuff and organize all my spare parts from different different ones and then I put away all the boxes. Okay. Her little tea. I do like the little tea. Or a little cup of coffee or whatever. Got a crack in it? Oh no, it's just the seam line. So um yeah, and here's a little plate that goes with it too. Did not expect that at all. And this one, oh, this is for the hat. Cause she can hold, there's a way she can hold the hat as well. She can hold the hat as well. And this has like a little indent thing so she can hold it. Um, and here's the other earring. I don't know if you want to say extra though, because she does have two head sculpts. So she has, you know, one for each head sculpt. Um, and of course the umbrella. And it does go together. But, oh no, it holds it. I was a bit worried it wouldn't hold the weight. It's a bit flimsy though. So I can totally see why they gave that extra stand for it. Because that is heavy. Probably gonna leave this in the box though. I'm probably not gonna. Probably not gonna use that at all because that's way too big for my organizer parts. And then all the extra parts over there. So um yeah, that's pretty much everything she comes with. She comes with a lot of, you know, chain swap out arms, um, which is good because these ones, you know, their arms are pretty fixed and they're just single pieces of plastic they're not um posable like i'm used to with my figmas and my ninja that's why i like figmas so much i like the scale of them because that chibi for me sometimes it irritates me with the art style um that's why i don't like them as much but if it's cheap and it's a real you know one i'll, I'll definitely pick it up um so overall i think it's freaking great you know paying ten dollars i bought more stuff too but um you know just for for adding just throwing an extra item and then going with it and you know i think at the end it was like a 300 dollars order or something altogether but anyways um great little figure you know i freaking love the anime so oops so if it's a cheap enough figure i'll definitely buy it if it's a good enough price and then if it's a character i really do care about a lot of course i'll i'll definitely pick up something crazier but um i think that's gonna be it for this one i'm just gonna clean up and put everything else away and so uh, I think that's all I got, all I got for today, but thanks for watching.